in Oregon, you'll find a mixed bag of property types, including farmland and residential subdivisions. <laughs> Mike Twill's property on Brown Road is a combination of the two, with a home for his family, which includes three kids, and his collection of 20 chickens. My kids, they love pets just like me. And that love for animals now has Twill, who didn't want to appear on camera, in a bitter battle with neighbors over his proposal to add peacocks and ponies to the animals on his 2.2 acre property. And I just wanted something extra to, uh, for looks, for, uh, you know, beauty. But at least one neighbor who didn't want to be identified is skeptical that the animals will be as majestic as Twill claims. Peacocks are very noisy, very aggressive. Some also question if Twill has the space on his property to build the type of enclosure that would be needed for these types of animals. If he wanted to buy, if he wanted to have all these animals, he should have brought a farm where he could have had all those and nobody would have said a word. Twill says he does have the space and enclosure needed to house the peacocks and also has what's needed to clean up after his new ponies, should he be allowed to have them. I have somebody coming over every once a week cleaning everything to make everything spotless. For those against the addition, however, it's not just about what animals he wants to bring to the neighborhood now, but what approval of his request could mean in the future. If he would get permission, then. Uh, they uh, are all, you know, he, they could put in anything they wanted. Now, the Oregon City Council has a public hearing on Twill's application to bring the ponies and peacocks to his property. That meeting is scheduled for June the 25th at 8 p.m. Now we. Want